So pull your forefingers towards your thumbs, press your toenails down, lengthen your tailbone, pull your pubic bone towards your sternum. So now you're all connected in your lower body. So your upper body then will have freedom to begin to open. Press your fingertips down and slowly begin to look towards your heart as you peel your heart up off the floor on an inhale. Now the inhale inflates breath like a balloon up into your armpits and underneath your collarbones. Now as you exhale, anchor your navel to your spine, squeeze your thighs, so you're really connecting through your lower body, staying integrated. And then the exhale, because the lower body is stable, the opening begins to go in the, into your upper body. So as you exhale, you melt the back of your heart forward, keeping your core engaged, your shoulders draw back, and then you can gaze in the direction your heart is pointing. The thing with heart openers is you want to gaze in the direction your heart is pointing so that your neck is never just kinking like a hose. Once you kink somewhere in your spine, you cannot open another area. So that place of vulnerability, of hyperextension, um, will always take the bend, slowly curl back down.